and welcome to another Justice video. Folks, we finally have another Eternals trailer. Yes, I am super hyped. To oh watch this my one. god, the first trailer was so good. We had to rewatch it right before recording this video just to refresh our memory. And I was yeah. just, oh, man, the visuals, the music. It definitely did a good job of painting a picture of what the Eternals are gonna look like, kind of how the movie's yeah. gonna fit, like feel. Mm -hmm. But it definitely gave us a lot of questions too. We still don't know if the Celestials are gonna be in it at all. We haven't gotten yeah. a glimpse of that yet. Yet, so I don't know I'm hoping that we see something in this movie about it And we still don't have a clear picture of how the Eternals and the humans and the deviants if there is gonna be any deviants in the movie yeah. We still don't know how that all fits together mm -hmm. And if you're curious about what all that means check out our first reaction video We actually yeah. kind of give a little bit of an explanation too of who the Eternals are and kind of who created them The Celestials and humans how they were given the mutant gene yeah. the deviants and how that's all connected So go ahead and check out our first reaction video if you're curious about that. And so there's actually been quite a bit happening in the MCU since yeah. that trailer came out too. Like we got Loki now. So we, Loki was massive. Exactly. We have a much better understanding of time and how all that works. The yeah. mechanics behind that now too. And so. the different multiverse as yeah. well. You yeah. know what I mean? So I hope that this movie ties in a lot of the things that we've been learning, a lot of the questions that we have, but we're just gonna have to check out this trailer and find yeah. out. All right, let's jump into it. Five years ago, Thanos erased half of the population of the universe. Okay. But the people of this planet brought everyone back with a snap of a finger. The sudden return of the population provided the necessary energy for the emergence to begin. Seven days. That sounds biblical. That's crazy. The whole thing. We're Eternals. That was a celestial. We came here 7,000 years ago to protect humans from the deviants. Okay. Whoa, whoa, was that a deviant? Why didn't you guys help fight Thanos? Or any war, or all the other terrible things throughout history. We were instructed not to interfere in any human conflicts unless deviants are involved. Instructed? By who? <laughs> oh. oh my god. We need to find the others. I haven't seen some of them for centuries. Hi. Hello. They're getting this the band the back together. The looks like. Since we have front row seats. You know what's never saved the planet? Your sarcasm. <laughs> we have loved these people since the day we arrived. When you love something, you protect it. Well, what's this even made of? Vibranium? Oh. <laughs> Fall collection. Ikea. <laughs> Fall collection, I love that! That's amazing, okay. Dude, I, I was Dude. really impressed with that. Yeah, that was a fantastic trailer. He like, mentioned vibranium, that's cool. That is cool, yeah, <laughs> it's like we know them. Yeah. <laughs> Dude, we got to see the Celestials. We Two know. Of them. Yeah. Two. Yeah, we know oh. that they're gonna be in it now. And oh my god, first of all, they look incredible. Second yes. of all, we're taking orders? Yeah. We're dude, taking orders from the Celestials. That's that's a trip. Like, dude, and it was so well 
done like getting across like the scale of when that first one popped up like you can tell that's yeah. a massive motherfucker yeah the emergence For, what is the emergence what does that mean is it like the deviants were sort of like dormant or something like in some way and then it, boom it called them back no, or it, it looks like something was sent to us too or came back yeah but which could have triggered an awakening i don't know i don't know dude it's and so what we do know is the eternals were instructed to not deal with us unless it had to do with the deviants yeah so we now know for sure that the deviants are going to be in the movie too the eternals have been protecting us throughout history we even talked about that in the first reaction we maybe saw the eternals throughout history as our heroes protecting yeah. us against the deviants. Yeah. That's exactly how it's gonna play out. That's really cool. Yeah, I'm, I'm super excited. Like, and uh, the dude where on the, his hand, and it was like guns he shot. Yeah. That was pretty trippy. Yeah, that was cool. Seven days. Yeah. That's a pretty short timeline. Very, yeah. Yeah. Can I just say too, I love the look of their shit. Oh yeah, dude, me like, too. Like, dude, that's probably what the they, they, that's probably what the Phoenix Lights were. Yeah, <laughs> they came to check on us. <laughs> this moment, oh my god. Yes. When we learned who they were taking orders for. Well, at least it's insinuating that they're taking orders from the Celestials, but we actually don't know if that's entirely true yet. We don't know the mm -hmm. full picture. My Eternals are innocent until proven guilty. <laughs> not to say that the celestials would be bad but if they're telling them to not intervene unless it has to do with this one thing i don't know what do they hate about the deviants so much do you think that the celestials look at the deviants as like their creation gone wrong that they can't get rid of and they're having their perfect creation help exterminate them what if it's like something crazy where like it's a competition between the two and like they don't care which one. That's part of the experiment. Oh my god, it always it goes back to the experiment. That's actually that's a good way to think about it because you have to think about what would the cuz these things would be at the top of the food uh, chain and when it comes yeah. to like this might be a dumb way, but if you think about it like the video game civilization, you know, you have one going culture victory and another one going war victory, you know what I mean? Military victory. And it's like, they're they're just like the ones overseeing it to yeah. see which one wins. Yeah, cause like beings with this much power, this much knowledge, like what would they be interested in? Well, maybe they're just interested in their creations and just creating these sick things for them to do and, and, yeah. and, pl and events to play out and just they're amused by it. I can only imagine what they think about Kang the Conqueror and Loki and what's Dude, all happening there. Yeah, that's that's interesting. Like, I wonder how far their power goes. Like, I wonder if Celestials are, or even Eternals, but mainly Celestials, I wonder if they're Nexus beings, meaning oh. they can travel from universe to universe or even experience or use them in some way. You know, they're so powerful. I, I could see that. You them know? being Nexus yeah, beings? Yeah, them being like... I mean, I know there's only, you know, so many styles they can go with, but this Celestial definitely is giving off some Wanda Maximoff vibes. Oh, shit. You know, with the, with the red energy. So I'm almost wondering if, you know, they're all kind of pulling from the same type of energy, this oh, kind of Celestial yes. type energy. It might all come from them. So yeah, I mean, this trailer was really, really good. And again, it answered a lot of questions. We definitely have a better feel of where this movie is headed and what kind of picture they're painting for us, but it definitely gave us a lot of questions too. <laughs> oh, definitely. 100%. Yeah. I'm really curious to see how everything in the MCU up to this point is all going to kind of build this together and kind of what this is all going to meet up to, you know? Yeah. So yeah, let us know down in the comments below your thoughts and theories about this. Yeah. What do you think the Celestials have to do with this? Do you really think that they are in charge of the Eternals and the Eternals are taking orders from them? Or do you think that maybe it might be one of the Eternals? Do you think Mm, yeah, do you, interesting. Do you think there might be some drama in there and that all the all of the Eternals might not be in on this? I feel you. You know? Okay. Yeah, let us know what you think down below. And on that note, check us out on Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter at Justice Band. I hope everyone out there has an excellent week. And until next time, catch you on the flip.